primer on public budgeting. What is a government budget? The budget is a central policy document of government, showing how annual and sometimes multi-annual objectives will be prioritized and achieved through the raising and reallocation of financial resources. It is a political expression of the decisions taken by a country's executive body to raise revenues through taxation, profits on government's activities or borrowing, and to allocate public resources in accordance with public policy priorities to, among other, purchase of goods and services to provide public services such as education, health, or defense, pay social security and other transfers or support priority infrastructure or other projects or sectors through public investment and other incentives such as subsidies or tax privileges. The government budget is an integral part of national development strategies. Among the key principles in public budgeting are ensure that public spending is in line with available resources, allocate resources effectively between different expenditure areas in pursuit of the desired government development policy objectives, ensure that resources are used in such a way that they provide maximum value for money. In legal terms, government budget or appropriations, is the budget approved by the legislature and subsequent additions to it. This makes order the executive to make the specified expenditures or authorize the executive to make expenditures up to the amounts specified. The authorization to spend may be given to individual ministries or departments, or it may be granted specifically to the chief executive or his representative who retains the freedom to subsequently authorize spending by the government. A typical government budget goes through a standard annual cycle that consists of six stages, strategic budgeting, budget formulation, budget approval, budget execution, budget monitoring and reporting, and budget audit and evaluation. During the strategic budgeting phase resource allocation is considered from the viewpoint of the national policy objectives that the budget is expected to help achieve. It is about setting up of fiscal targets and a compatible level of expenditure and formulating expenditure policies in conformity with both. The budget formulation is preparing detailed budget submissions, often first by line ministries to the Ministry of Finance, which then finalizes the integrated budget proposal. Budgets are then approved by parliaments in the form of an annual budget law during the budget approval phase. This is followed by the budget execution when expenditures are incurred to undertake activities and deliver on expected results. The monitoring of expenditures phase is expected to assess whether the resources are allocated as planned leading to an annual reporting to the parliament on budget implementation. The audit and evaluation phase is essential in understanding the effectiveness and efficiency of the incurred public expenditures this avis stated and obtained results. Key Stakeholders The key stakeholders in the budgeting process include Head of Government, Ministry of Finance, Revenue Authority, Line Ministries, Auditor General and Parliament. The Cabinet presents the budget proposal to Parliament for approval. The Ministry of Finance leads on the budget preparation and coordinate submissions from line ministries' budgetary or spending units. The Auditor General controls the effectiveness and efficiency of expenditures. The influence and interest of these stakeholders in SDG budgeting will vary across different budget systems. The typical situation would be when Line ministries are amongst the most interested parties in seeking improved SDG-based budget allocations, but hardly the most influential in promoting and pursuing adjustments, so budgets start speaking SDG language. Ministries of finance will be more influential to perform that task, but they may not be the most interested ones in new comprehensive governance agenda. Similarly, the supreme audit institutions may be more focused on the technical side of effectiveness without consideration of how the budget supports the achievement of the SDGs, parliaments, members of parliaments, and government as a whole. At the prime ministerial level, may locate somewhere in between line ministries and finance ministries, 
to reflect the collective responsibility over the 2030 Agenda. The role of Parliament will vary greatly from country to country, depending on how much leverage it has over budget formulation. In countries with more open budgeting process, CSO may also be important stakeholders involved in discussions during budget preparation and contributing to mechanisms aimed at strengthening accountability. In countries with high levels of decentralization, local governments are very important stakeholders in the budgeting process. The key laws and regulations that govern the formulation, approval, and execution of government budgets are the Constitution, the Organic Law, Financial Regulations, Annual Budget Law or Appropriate Act, Procurement and Civil Service Laws, etc. Public budgets are simultaneously economical, legal, and political tools. As such, they are the most powerful instruments to ensure that policies, plans, and priorities of governments are implemented.